One day, this little orange cat just jumps up and he's just scratching and scratching. And I thought it was the funniest thing. <laughs> and then it happened again, and then it happened again. And it just really doesn't get old, it's so cute. <laughs> The very first time that he came over, I asked if we could get a fish because it was lonely, just the two of us in there. And maybe five minutes later, this cat walks in the door while it was open. I was freaking out. It's a sign. Oh my gosh. And I was so excited. We didn't make the decision to let him in. He just invited himself and waltzed right in. Good morning, baby. Mm. He kind of just came in and showed us who's boss. My boyfriend told me that the owner said that he knows that the cat roams. <gasps> he just went in. It's very common that a lot of people in this area do let their cats just kind of roam outside and they'll go home as they wish. This cat was just so friendly and so cute. Oh, baby. It was like he already knew us and trusted us so quickly. He almost has a routine when he comes in. He comes in, he always sniffs around the apartment and finds things that are new. No! and then takes a long nap. Give me a kiss. One day, I took out the cord of my iPhone charger and just started waving it around, almost like those fish on a string toys, and he went absolutely crazy. <laughs> After a while, he'll just go walk in front of the door, kind of his signal when he's ready to go. So we open it and off he goes. He's had a few sleepovers at this point. The very first time was probably a few weeks after he first started coming over. It's to be bedtime and he's still there. My boyfriend tried opening the door and saying, okay, go on. And he just did not seem interested. He was very content where he was. We kind of laughed like, I guess he's sleeping over. <laughs> he visits at least once a day, if not more. Any little thing he does, I think is the cutest thing in the world. <laughs> and I'm like, oh my gosh, I know what it's like when people have kids now. I get so excited because he's not our cat per se. And I think having that time limited as well is really exciting. I still get so excited when he comes over. Carmelo the neighbor cat, Carmelo the neighbor cat. Carmelo has made me a lot happier. Like I said, it was just lonely with the two of us there, and now we have a third. It gives me something to look forward to. He's very calming to be around. I hope he feels the same, that he looks forward to coming over with us and getting all those chin scratches and having a perfect nap spot. It's really nice having this part-time cat. It's his world. We're all just living in it. <laughs>